Okay, I'm going to show you how we take this bagel and cut it into two parts that are linked together like a chain. I'm going to cut in at the end here and then cut to vertically over here and then down to horizontally on the inside here and do that same cut four times just rotating 180 degrees in between each cut. So we start horizontally and cut vertically and then down to the inside rotate 180 start at the same spot cut vertically and then horizontally down to the bottom turn 180 degrees again cut in to vertically and to horizontally inside and one more 180 degree cut vertically soft in here. There. Now we just have to tease it apart gently and it'll separate into two pieces. And there we have it. Two equal linked parts. I like to toast my bagels. You want to be sure and move them around a little bit so it doesn't cook just on one spot. Let's get them a little twirl a few times while toasting. And if you're like me, you'll like a little cream cheese on them. And the interesting question is, how much extra cream cheese do you get? How much more surface area is there on this bagel than on a regular bagel?